Hi, this is Steve Carrington, Palmer Mayor, bringing you five days into the future for our May 9th, 2023 Palmer City Council meeting. That's at six o'clock. Actually, I should note that at five o'clock, there's a joint meeting with our Parks and Rec Board. So between five and six, we'll be meeting as a, jointly with the Parks and Rec Board to discuss. We try to do that with each of our boards and commission um, throughout the once at least throughout the year. So that will be our time for that. Then for our regular council meeting, we've got approval of the last meeting minutes for April 25th, the regular meeting, and April 25th, the emergency meeting. Those minutes will be there. There's proclamations for recognizing the Palmer High School cheer team, uh, recognizing PHS Female Athlete of the Year, Tori McLean, and uh, PHS, PHS Male Athlete of the Year, Kaysen Assay. And then there'll be a presentation from the City Finance Director, uh, Gina Davis, uh, talking about Alaska Remote Sellers Sales Tax, which basically means online sales tax collection and how that works. Say that again. So in my mayor's report, I uh, mentioned that I attended the Valley Pastors Prayer Network um, Day of Prayer on May 4th. Um, I had a meeting also with uh, Mike Brown, manager for the borough, and kind of trying to understand and talk about the MPO or the Matsu Valley Planning for Transportation. Trying to make sure, you know, ask all the questions I could to try to understand the background of what's all involved with that. Um, I've also set up and kind of started to have, trying to have a meeting with Tim Pettit, the CEO of Matsu Senior Services, trying to explore ways that the city and the senior services could work together. And uh, also was a judge for the World World Fair at Academy Charter School. That was that was a lot of fun, and uh, got to participate in that. And then, of course, uh, there's upcoming this weekend is the Valley Croman Wheels. Did I get that right? Yeah, MTA Valley Croman Wheel Car Show at the MTA Event Center, as well as the Great Alaska Aviation Gathering at both the fairgrounds and the airport Saturday and Sunday. Uh, for public hearings, we have uh, one accepting the 2023 State of Alaska, Alaska High Visibility, Click It or, click, click it or Ticket. Um, that's a grant to the amount of $4,480. Um, but there will be a public hearing about that. And another resolution in support of the Matsu Valley Planning for Transportation, or MVP for Transportation, or the M Metropolitan Planning Organization. This will be the second uh, public hearing will be doing on that. And then under action memoranda, we've got one for the city manager and an agreement, uh, looks like for an SRO, uh, safety, safety resource officer uh, for Colony High School. And then uh, we've got another one for a contract with the borough for fire emergency response to Greater Palmer area. And then a liquor license renewal for the Moose and authorizing the city manager to negotiate enter into a contract for $425,002 for the 2023 Evergreen Avenue and Airport Road Pathway Project. And also in a memorandum for, to, uh, for $153,961.65 for cracked ceiling roadways, runways, parking aprons, and infrared pothole patching and street line striping in 2023. So this has been Steve Carrington taking you five days, okay, well, to this time it might be four days into the future for our May 9th Palmer City Council meeting. Is that the trolley? What color sign does he have on it? Is it blue or is it red? <laughs>